I have been trying to get into beers for the last maybe month or two. I'm just not a beer person. Like, I just can't get with beers. But what I wanted to do for the month of June was have like wine coolers or like refreshers or you know, like the not so hard liquor type of drinks like the little the lightweight stuff basically because that's what i think about when it comes to summer yeah i think about drinking and mixing drinks and all of that good stuff but not so much hard liquor and sometimes you don't want wine so that's what i'm shooting for for the month of july basically little so this saturday i have cayman jack margarita and it's kind of heavy jack margarita organic limes and real cane sugar um arguably the world's most refreshing margarita you get six and i mean it's a nice size bottle honestly that that's that's a nice size bottle girl look all chocolate with my curly hair um what else six of these each one is 11.2 ounces that's that's pretty good size and it contains 5.8% alcohol by volume. Pregnant women should not drink. This is handcrafted using only the finest ingredients. Okay. And on the side it says 100% blue agave nectar, organic lime juice, and natural cane sugar. Using all natural ingredients makes a difference. Sure, it's a little harder to make it that way, but that's how we make it. Arguably the world's most refreshing margarita. Um, it's gluten-free for all the people that's, you know, gluten-free, sulfate-free or whatever. But this one doesn't say if it has sulfites or whatever in it, so do your own research. I'm not tripping. Uh, yeah. Okay, so on the bottom, I'll do a close up. At Cayman Jack, it's all about the taste. Cayman Jack searched the world to find the freshest, most natural tasting ingredients, sailing from island to island and tasting hundreds of margaritas along the way. I wish I had that job. Well, someone had to do it. He searched out small family growers who pride themselves on the quality of their organic limes, using the uh, using only. <laughs> Using only natural cane sugar, 100% agave, CJ's secret margarita recipe became the hit of the islands. So enjoy what is arguably the most refreshing margarita in the world while Cayman Jack sails off in search of his next amazing cocktail. Then it, it's an ale. Is this beer? I know I did not pick up beer. Y'all can't even see me. I understand all the way. I hope this is not beer. I did not want a beer. And then it has like this little step-by-step -step on how to craft craft knowledge from Cayman Jack, the art of tying the perfect bow tie. I hope this ain't beer. Oh, that smells just like a margarita. It smells just like a restaurant or bar margarita. You can't see. Okay. That's not bad. If this was like, that tastes like margarita. <laughs> That's good, honestly. This was like, for the six pack, I believe it was $8 at wines more it tastes just like a margarita but it does have like that kind of like that beer aftertaste so if you don't really like beer i don't really care for beer but i can deal with this because it tastes more like a margarita than it does beer so i like it i would get it again i think next time i'll like put it in the freezer and like let it get all slushy That's good.
Yeah, this is an L. Or is it? I don't know. Okay, so. It's really sweet. Tastes like a margarita. The color, it looks like a margarita. It almost looks like my backdrop. Tastes really sweet. Tastes like a margarita. Looks like a margarita. This is a nice size bottle. Um, it says something about an ale on the packaging, but it does not really taste like beer. And it's cheap. So I personally would get it again. I did not see any other Cayman Jack products. Maybe I overlooked it, but I only seen this. This is a really cute bottle. Like it, it just fits perfectly in my hand. This is really good. It is good. I like it a lot. I would give it. I would give it mm, 3.5 wine bottles out of 5 wine bottles. <laughs> yeah, I'll give it 3.5 out of 5. Just for the fact that it said L and maybe I just overlooked that in the store. I just thought this was a baby margarita. I honestly did. I thought it was a baby margarita. Um, so if it is kind of like a margarita beer flavored or margarita beer flavored margarita, I kind of don't want to deal with beer. But other than that, I definitely will get it again. Like it's really no cons except for the fact I'm confused on whether it's a margarita or if it's beer or if it's, um, beer flavored margarita, you know, but it tastes really good. 